So, final port of call this week then is Hereford, and it's the Hereford Club Hurdle, which is the first one of five from here at Hereford then, and it's a three mile nought to one ten handicap. The top one is Olga Barriosova, Martin Leedham, Buzzer Time, Daniel French, Thunder, Derek Hinton, Sea Devil, Graham Clitterbuck, Quack, Kevin Meenan, Grain Ambient, Ambience, Darren Howes, Montoya, James Follis, Radio Missile, Alex Cherry, Johnny Cash, Derek Hinton, and Moya Super, Alex Cherry, Sister Winning and Excellent Down, both from Doug Warren Racing, for Richard, Darren Howes, King George, Stu Gray, and Trabago, James Follis. So 15 then, face the starter, Hereford. The weather is a little more clement than it has been at most of the other places we've been this week, and they're called in and away. Well, this first of five from here then, and Thunder, one of the first shows, a short run to the first, and they're all quickly skipping over the first hurdle. They've got 14 more to take, 15 in all. We see the view from the stand as they come past the winning post for the first of a couple of more times yet. And Johnny Cash and Thunder, the two Derek Hinton horses, are showing the way home at this early stage of the race, being chased by the grey buzzer time and full richer in the orange with the black sleeves of Darren Howes then. So sort of themselves out. King George is just the back marker, but it's Derek Hinton to the fore then. Thunder and Johnny Cash. That is anything to do with his record collection, Thunder and Johnny Cash. I'm sure, let us know. It's Thunder who's just the leader. Johnny Cash is second. Four Richard is third. Then Buzzer Time the Grey is fourth. And they gap into a Moya Super and just head to the main body of the field as they skip over flight number two. Make their way towards the third past that big looking building as they jump over that one. Race away towards the next end. So Thunder's the leader. Johnny Cash is second. Four Richard is third. Then Buzzer Tomer and Moya Super with Montoya after that one. I think Grain Ambience and Excellent Down. Sea Devil's well placed in the centre of the pack. Trabago just behind that one. Then the sister winning on the inside. Olga Barriosova and King George are next. And the back marker is just quack. So they're racing towards the next end and they skip over number four. They're all hurdling quickly and well. And make sure they all keep away from that really dangerous looking electric fence over on the far side as they skip over the next one. And they're also going over that one as well with Olga Barriosova now relegated to the back spot. But Thunder and Johnny Cash are yet to be headed with four Richard just tucked in behind them. The only grey in the race is Buzzer Time. That's a bit of a rarity in a field this size when they so six normally two or three greys and a Moya Super is behind that one Sea Devil making a forward move excellent down the first of the Doug Warren horses with Grain Ambience the second Darren Howells behind that one and just burst in between the two of them King George for Stu Grey as they skip over number six all over that one okay with Thunder showing the way by about a length and a half to stable companion Johnny Cash and four Richard is going to Try and split them in a minute, I think, as they take number seven. Probably just does so on landing the grey buzzer time. It's just a little bit wide on the track. The jockey's pushing that now to try and take a little bit closer order as well. Radio Missile has been relegated to the back of the pack. And Thunder continues to lead as they come up the straight. Once again, next time round is the one that'll count. And Thunder will be hoping to be in the lead still at that point but his lead's down to half a length now as they jump that one four Richards moved up nicely into second buzzer time is third and king george moved up as well into fourth and a moya super johnny cash is just losing his place a little bit then comes montoya and sea devil excellent down is after that quacks made significant progress around the outside of the field and sister winning is after that the back three are trabago olga barriosova and radio missile who is not going to go out on the final circuit and they call it a day that one so the first one to depart the race and for Richard it's going up on the outside of Thunder and we're losing another one now Grain Ambience has gone so the, the pull-ups have started in earnest here at Hereford and Thunder continues to show the way and a third quickly pulled up there is Trabago so suddenly three horses pulled up in the space of a couple of furlongs and Olga Barriosova at the back is now in that perilous position as they come down to take this one in the shadow of this building where the ground should be a bit softer than everywhere else you would have thought and thunders the leader from Johnny Cash who's gone back up again on the outside into second four Richard and Buzzer time just been given a bit of a breather quack has moved well nicely around the outside Sea Devil's always been in a decent position after that one comes King George and Amoya Super and Sister winning then Excellent down and Montoya Olga Barriosova is going to try and get up the inside 
but they've got less than seven furlongs to race now then and they're coming down towards the next flight and thunder has had it pretty much all his own way in the lead so far but sea devil is now making a big forward move as they take the 11th they've got four more to take and it's thunder in the lead sea devil is second johnny cash is third and quack is four then three in a line buzzer time by a super and four richer and then over that one that's the four full home making good ground up the inside is olga barrios of a king george has dropped to the back but it's johnny cash thunder sea devil and quack virtually four in a line now then as they begin to make their way towards the turn towards home and quack has now taken it up so quack into the front and quickly cuts across to the inside the same ground good jockey ship there and quacks in the lead from sea devil in second thunder is third then johnny cash and moya super come round the outside sister wooden is getting into it now here comes olga barriosova with a run as well as they take the third last and over that one it's quack in the lead quack's gone for home already quack leads from a moya super in second sea devil in second then olga barriosova then comes buzzer time and sister winning johnny cash thunder let both look out of it now and as they take the second last and quack has gone eight lengths clear Quacks clear of a Moya Super. Sea Devils in third. Then Sister winning a buzzer time. Olga Barriosova can't carry the weight, but it's Quack who's making his way towards home now. Then he's got just one more flight to take. He's got less than a foot and a half to race, and he's an absolute mile in front. It's Quack from Sea Devil and a Moya Super. Quack's surely just got to jump this final flight to make a pretty easy win, and over that one he goes. Second place, Sea Devil, then a Moya Super and Thunder trying to run on again, but Quack has taken this by an absolute mile up towards the line. Is this really a handy? Cap him. Quack has taken it. And Moya Super may have got up to his second ahead of Sea Devil, but an amazing race there. Johnny Cash ended up last. And Quack for Kevin Meenahan has won that by six and a quarter lengths from a Moya Super Alex Cherry second. Sea Devil for Graham Clutterbuck was third. Thunder for Derek Hinton stuck on for fourth. An excellent down for Doug Warren was fifth.